Hey, welcome or welcome back to the channel. Today, we're checking out the second season of The Boys. This is the first episode entitled The Big Ride. Okay, so season two of The Boys won out on a recent poll on the channel. You can find them either in your feed or in the community tab. But The Boys season two beat out Stranger Things season four by just a little bit. And then Westworld season four brought up the rear. Just know that I'm watching all of these shows in November or December. I'm starting them all. So big takeaways from last season. Uh, I mean, we were introduced to Huey and the boys, all these soups. Really curious to see where they go with things, especially because of the ending with Compound V and, you know, Homelander having this kid through <laughs> through Butcher's ex-wife and, and, and the kid has powers. And then so with no more stalling, this is season two of the boys. The first episode, the big wave, no, the big ride, right? Uh, it rings of power had the great wave. That's different. Anyway, this is the season two premiere of The Boys. Looking forward to more gratuitous violence and mayhem and blood everywhere. Let's just get into it. This is the first episode, The Big Ride. Here we go. Uh, adult violence, graphic violence, adult gra content, graphic language. Whew, I just, <laughs> everything went everywhere. A, re a recap of season oh, one. Man! Oh. Is it skippable? So who's the new Madeline? Gustavo I'm Fring. I'm on Whom exactly do your heroes report to? Same person as always. Me. Copyrighted music, gotta mute this shit. She's fucking dead. Half our own heroes don't know they have compound B in their veins. You want China finding out? Wow, so shit's rolling forward. Who is doing all this bloodletting? Black Noir. I love jaw jaw related deaths. I know that's very specific and strange, but it's a conversation for another time, perhaps. He's try trying to get a slogan. <laughs> yeah. Not bad. Mm. Black Noir is just cleaning house. That's the most of him we've seen is his insides. What a cut. That was good. I gotta know more about Black Noir. Is he like Spawn? Is he just gonna necro generate? Like <laughs> the Black Noir has conducted an operation, killing the super terrorist known as Nakib. For today, we oh. mourn a fallen member of the Seven, murdered in cold blood <laughs> by the cartel super terrorist El Diablo. They don't have a body though to For bury, left, so they, it just. But they couldn't tell anyway because he's dead. So me, like. You find those super terrorists. This murdering piece of shit. I'll do it for you. Do it for him. For America. Do they really have the chunks of him in the box? For a dear. Cleaned up, or is it just something? Dear old friend. They haven't pressed to look like he's laying in there. <laughs> it's like it's like the leftovers with the disappearing people in the pictures. He's coming from fucking pigs and they can't cut me out! Okay, that's enough. Time to go. Like, he was a pervert. And a creep. And she had to sing to him. That's ridiculous. And they got her in that get out, too. Yeah, but this one, he's just really been a rock. He sat us down, and he said, we're more than just a team. I can't we're believe this shit. And we need to pull together like one. What is she doing? I don't. Oh, she's selling it really well. Where we would be without you. Or is she just doing it to be fucking super spiteful? <laughs> Isn't she the best? <laughs> Jenner's closet. <laughs> fucking. <laughs> uh, arguably lower than how he started in the first season, since he had a girl and a house and a home and. He lost her, but now he's just starting out in the fucking closet. Are they 
preparing for their day or are they meeting somewhere? Like it, Normally you see a montage when there's two people getting ready for a date, but they're not on good terms. Fuck you going. Uh, I'm wanted and you're kind of super famous, so... Uh... No one followed me down here and they can't even trace my chip down here. We're okay. Very next stop. You're under arrest. You're you look good, too. You look very, you know... Uh, Ruggedly tired. <laughs> yeah, I'm lying. I'm sorry. You look like shit. I know. I'm glad they're not on completely terrible terms, you know. Here it is. I know him. Is he a target of theirs or does I have a choice? He just want information from the guy. He's an actor who didn't lie to my face every day. Ah, uh, well how would you know if he's a good actor? Okay, Maybe he yeah, is. Ouch. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I Are you? Just... Are you though? <laughs> that whole thing if you break a plate and then say sorry, you know, hey. you just put it back together. <laughs> Splash zone. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. You think this is fun? Yeah, what's he up to? <laughs> I think water's supposed to be fun. You try swimming in the Mariana Trench, you little <laughs> fucking idiots. Yeah, not so fun now. No, it's dark and it's cold. And you're so alone. His meltdowns and his failures with the animals and, and, and everything he's doing. Hey man. Wanna fresca? What? <laughs> What kind of Thanks. product placement is this? I know you. Eagle the Archer. Out of Cleveland, we met like five times at Bacon. Why? Because even heroes need a hand once in a while. Mm, no. There's something in it for him. Please. My baby needs a mother. Oh, no. Oh, I... He'll... <laughs> wow. They're setting up Butcher so bad. That is fucked up. And why was Madeline Stillwell's baby found safe in a yard 17 miles away? It is a puzzle. These are among the many Hugh Campbell or this man whose real identity is unknown. Ah, <laughs> Frenchie is unknown. Now someone there going to turn him in? Probably not, right? Guys, we get some compound V. We, we bring it to the New York Times. We burn Vought to the ground. You got some V, Huey? Because I don't. We could get some. Someone... <laughs> Could help us get it. This is over. But the CIA was gonna protect his family, right? Or did that go out the window with the deal? I forget. I just know shit didn't work out. Oh, you got the titty milk? Don't be weird. Ew, <laughs> he's gonna be I saw what he did, he was with his mouth. Ugh. Warming it up. <laughs> what a disgusting thing. What a weirdo. This is bothering me more than I think it should. Ashley! <clears throat> you were fired. Where? Glad to see you're uh, making yourself at home. Homelander, I just want to thank you again for recommending me for this job. A Madeline replacement or just back in the company I'm somewhere? Phil. Miss Stillwell shoes as best I can. Any luck catching her killer that... Butcher maniac? Yeah, we haven't seen him yet. Yeah. Is he in hiding or with his wife? I think I found a hero. Perfect candidate to replace Translucent. Really? Mm-hmm. You want to meet him? Do I? Yeah, your office isn't even <laughs> set up work? yet, and you got fucking replacements. It's a blind spot, right? A differently abled member of the Seven. And then I think we find an ethnic or female, or, fingers crossed, an ethnic female to replace the Deep, and we're golden. <laughs> Then we got the cast of Overwatch 2. That's, a, that's impressive. And you don't need super eyes when you have super ears. I just have one question, if that's okay. Yeah. So... Uh, what happens what if happens boom? If, yeah. Um, I don't know. I do this. <laughs> and now you're just another useless fucking blind guy. This must be some kind of a joke. I was kidding. Please. I was kidding. What made you think I would ever allow a cripple into the seven? For fuck's sake, Ashley, don't look at him. Look at me. <coughs> look at me. Look at me. You will tell me everything that goes on on the 99th floor, and I mean 
everything. I mean, I riff on things and make jokes in the moment because I kind of, I grew up with Mystery Science Theater 3000. But I didn't expect to really think that would happen or want it. Poor dude. <laughs> Yeah, very Black Mirror-esque right there. Looks like the guy. Uh, an arm, please, actually. He, he backed up the car and ran over the kid. I am so sorry, man. I am so sorry. I didn't even acting see you. Oh, oh, oh. This is like a hostile thing. But he Do regenerates or or chop or whatever flitch your boat tiger. Does it not hurt him or is he just so fucking used to it? This is like Nora from from the leftovers. She's doing some shit. We I I I'd keep the arm, right? I just keep it refrigerated. For an extra ground, I'll let you chop off my dick. What is the <laughs> You are treating yourself like meat, like butcherable meat. Ooh. Listen, he's broken every single bone in his arm, broken half his ribs. I can't do nothing here. You gotta take him to the hospital. You're gonna amputate the arm. That's like all the best you can do. Amputate the arm and wrap up the ribs. What do you say? What's going on? You say who did it or where it happened or. They're all here. What's the deal? Scorpion, New York. Is that the boat? And then... He promised me. You were only smuggling guns. So how did the boat get on the dock? Like, who, who supered that up there? That seems a little excessive. <laughs> we could have hit him with a box. They got paid to smuggle in a soup terrorist. How does it make you feel? Oh, Anyone? that sound on the board was horrible. I keep saying, super villain is the better term. Nope. It's saving America. Ah! Fuck him, he's... <laughs> I don't know. I, I feel like saving the world has a... I feel like all of them like the saving the world. It's Americans that are gonna keep us in the army, not the fucking world. Well, saving the world will let you get into more engagements that don't directly involve your country, though. Have a longer run if you're trying to save the world versus just America. Oh, shit, you scared me. That's just Carol. Good friend. Would you like a fresca? Is that Gretchen from Breaking Bad? It's tough. Yeah, are these frescas drugged? Wait a minute. I came to see that archery isn't irrelevant. It's timeless. It's a pure and ancient art. It's like Hawkeye in Age of Ultron. See these flying? We're fighting an army of robots. And I have a bow and arrow. None of this makes sense. How did you end up here? By your drinking, by your self-esteem issues, really open up, deep. No, thank you. Help you get back into the seven. Let me get back into. He hasn't been kicked out. Oh, oh Sam, with the marker on the paper. God damn. Boy, what boy? I do not understand. Why don't you just call nine one one? Wait, an anonymous tip? Yeah, sure. That'll go straight to the mayor. Okay, the CIA lady, right? Rainer? Right. The same CIA who wants to clamp our nuts. Yeah, it into some hung you out to dry and change the deal. And... Bart has her phone so bugged. They're praying that you do that. If you're the fucking reason why I can't finish that Vermont country dollhouse, I will fucking end you. <laughs> Listen, we helped the CIA lady. She could help you maybe get back to your family. Did you ever think of that? Gecko? Is that you? Gecko, because the things Scarlet? grow back. <laughs> ah. Yeah, at the uh, Capes for Christ Bible Camp. Mm -hmm. Yes, totally. That passion play we put on. You are the best Jesus. I mean, no one's going to take a nail through the hand like I can. And bacon, wow. Conscious pilot. I've got a hair just in my line of sight, and it's driving God me bonkers. There's nobody in the sky watching over us. Not God, not Homelander. So what did Huey want with the gecko? You know, why? What is she trying to get out of him? I need a favor. 
I need you to go into the labs on 67 and steal me a sample of compound V. <laughs> I know how we're made, and it is not Jesus. Or I put this on Facebook tonight. Is that gonna... Echo, former teen star of Vought, Summertime Clubhouse, where he is an s &M hooker. Damn. I thought that we were fine. I'm sorry. Are those extras I'm looking in through the window? You can never trust people in the background. Hi, you know who we are. But let's meet another hero. Queen Maeve and... This is Lance Corporal Dan Miller. With our new campaign, Saving America. Here I go, you guys. Wish me luck. Oh, FYI, not a real base. As if Homelander and Maeve are going to wow. eat them. Wow. Hi, my Nana's your biggest fan. I'm Stormfront. Great. Oh, right, yeah, from Seattle, right? Eyes are really fucking blue up close. <laughs> you are fun. <laughs> We don't work today. Uh, Let's go back to it. Oh, the boy's on 82. Are you I'm the new girl. On the 7? Social yeah, media I'm, parasite I'm lady. Replacing translucent. God bless his soul. Um, no, I don't think that this is... It's not true. I don't know anything about this. <laughs> She's so scared. Wow. Well... <laughs> You're uh, fucked. <laughs> who delivered the good news? Oh, uh, Mr. Miss Edgar, the big guy? Oh, Mr. E... Wow. Great. This is... <laughs> Great. Great. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I think this is going great. I like that they don't like her, but she bothers me too, so... Eh. Monica from The Expanse did it better. Calling her? Texting her? Are you crazy? You know, you sound like Butcher. She's on our side. I don't know. But I'm saying this for her, kid. Homelander finds out that she's yeah, been talking to you. Even if everything's safe on your end, yeah, she messes up on her side and gets caught. Her into this thing, the deeper in the meat grind that she goes. Do you think he killed Madeline so well? I'd like to think that he didn't, but I've been trying to put this puzzle together, and there's a missing piece, and it's been driving me nuts, and I think you just handed it to me. The whole picture? It's bought. It's a fucking coup from the inside. Wait, what are you talking about? Ma'am, you're that was Ah oh, shit! Fuck. The Holy, shit. Out. Holy shit! That got me. The audio on that fucked me up. Busy day. <laughs> he just barged in on, on so fucking Gus with, over here. Do you wish to be consulted on Stormfront? Oh, why not? I signed off on all the rest. You show my photo to some illiterate fucking camel jockey in the middle of the Sahara, he's gonna turn around and say, "Homelander in perfect American." You know, American. Not English, but American. Maybe it's time I uh, move on. How do you think your shareholders would feel about that? What do you know about Frederick Vaught? In 39, Hitler appointed him chief physician at Dachau, where he enjoyed a ready supply of human subjects on which to test his earliest iterations of Compound V. And he became as wonderbred American as Disney and Edison. Well, <laughs> Edison was a cunt, though, let's be wrestler. real. But you are under a misconception that we are a superhero company. We are not. What we are, really, is a pharmaceutical company. You slipped Compound V to terrorists all over the globe to get you and your cronies into national defense. I don't have to consult you about Stormfront or anything else. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> Maybe you have a premiere. Tech Knight lives to go to. Gus is dropping that knowledge on him. But what does Mr. Edgar have to protect him from, you know, if, say, he wants to burn his face out, you know? <sighs> Absolutely. Is Butcher going to answer the door? I mean, expect it to be the, the wife, Butcher's wife, Becca. What are you doing here? I've come to see my son. Oh yeah, yeah, her chunks are all over them, right? So glad you got us into this shit. And I got her killed. You didn't get her killed. How do you know? Because our brains aren't all over the dash, that's how. Someone was watching her. Reality check, this is our status. Huey, we did it. He's getting me the compound V in like a day or two. What do you think, um, 
New York Times. Oh, you're saying shit out loud. You're saying shit out loud. God, this is what we've been waiting for. She could be exploded Let's too. Burn those fuckers down. Thoughts just dangerous. That's all. I mean, you got to be careful. I don't want you. What is Stormfront's skill set? What does she do? I know when you're not telling me the truth, Huey. I kind of lived with it every single day. She just brings that up constantly. I mean, I know it's a big deal, but... I'm not. I swear to God. Whatever. I, um... I gotta go. I don't know. I felt like she was being watched that whole scene or something could have happened. All right. Easy does it, lads. Yeah. Easy does You're right, cunts. I, I tried to tell this cunt. <laughs> I'm a fat lot. But don't you worry. Daddy's home. <laughs> Where's he been, man? Like, I'm sure that'll be episode two, but we're going to the credits, aren't we? Oh. Well done. Are there x-ray features on this show? Like, with The Expanse, are there extras? I'm going to check it out. But if not, I'll see you all in the outro. Okay, Season 2, first episode, The Big Ride. Season 2, new and improved, now with 50% more explosive decapitations, terrorists, S&M hookers, cults, and a new pine fresh scent. But wait, there's more, two times the blood, guts, and gore than the other leading brands. This exclusive offer is only available, this exclusive offer is available only on Amazon Prime Video. Don't delay, order now. Okay. Okay, there it is. That was a lot of fun. It's good to be back in the show. I loved, I loved the fake Billy Butcher killing Madeline reenactment. It was kind of like the Matt Damon Loki, you know, play. Just, just like the, the mockery of it. We got to see Huey and the boys are definitely still on the run. And nothing they've been do doing is working. Meeting up with the CIA deputy director got her exploded all over them. But Billy Butcher came in at the end. No idea what he's been up to since the end of the last season, like why he was left alive. You know, what did he talk to Becca, the kid? Did Homelander just leave him there? Like what what happened? I forget the lady's name, but the the red headed girl who came back kinda of filling in for Madeline and uh got put in got put in her place when she tried to introduce a blind uh superhero to the team. I have no idea who this Stormfront character is. But I kind of find her obnoxious and vapid and annoying, and I'm sure they will too. But I don't know what her skill set is, but I, I guess we'll find that out as well. And Starlight and Huey, I mean, don't lie to me, don't lie to me again. It's, I mean, it's gonna happen. It's, it's actively on its way to happening, you know. She was able to secure this Compound V, hopefully, what's his name? I was gonna say the Chameleon. Salamander, the Gecko, like what? Whatever, the, the, the guy who grows stuff back, you know, he's claims to be nobody in the lab, but I'm sure maybe next episode we'll see that endeavor happen. Because Starlight said it would be in a day or two, so. Alright, so that's going to do it for me for now. Thank you all so much for being here. It's good to be back in the show. Uh, thank you all again for spending your time here. I hope it was worth it, and I look forward to the next episode. Thanks again, and goodbye.